The Florida Current, an online news service smartly covering politics and policy. Subscribe for free daily alerts at thefloridacurrent.com. It began in the panhandle. A Florida, Alabama state line, and these are our first steps. Two teams of two people have been walking Florida's beaches since mid-July. On their backs, a 40-pound, 360-degree camera pack. It's the state's latest effort to lure more people to the state. So it's a great opportunity to give pe wet people's appetite and help let them virtually explore the, the Florida beaches. Along their way, the trekkers, as they're called, were as much a tourist attraction as the beaches they walked. Kids in D.C. Florida had 91 and a half million tourists last year. The goal is 100 million, and marketers think the beach views will be one tool to help them reach their goal. It's not just a picture. You're able to show people what, you know, what, what their beach looks like and what, what, what their walk is going to be like in the morning or the sunset that afternoon. The trekkers have been covering about 50 miles a week. Their journey hasn't been without, well, surprises. What do you do with nude beaches? <laughs> well, our, Google, our Visit Florida team uh, uh, ran across a couple, uh, a couple of those beaches on their, on their trek through the state, and uh, they will be blurred out just like, the, uh, just like license plates on, on street cam for, for Google. The journey finishes next week on South Beach. The pictures go live early next year. Reporting in Tallahassee, I'm Mike Vasilinda.